What's up, what's up, everybody? It is your favorite trader, Tether God here, coming at you with another tutorial, right? So this right here is how to open up, deposit, withdraw, everything you need to know about your broker account. Now, the reason you need a broker account is because without this, you cannot trade. Without this, you cannot make money. Without this, you cannot withdraw, deposit, or anything Forex related. So you need a broker account right here. This right here is a very, very popular broker. Right, you can use whatever broker you wish to use. This is just a popular broker. I'm going to be using this as an example, right? So here is hugosway.com, right? So here you can sign up, create your account, right? Submit your first name, last name, email, password, all this good stuff. I already have an account, so I'm going to go straight to it. This is exactly what you're going to see once you actually create your account. Now, the first thing I'm going to need you to do is actually verify your account without your account being verified you cannot do anything you cannot trade right so first things first you're going to submit proof of id and proof of address right proof of id and proof of address now you need this right because the broker needs to verify that you are you you are who you say you are this is very legitimate and professional broker Right, so you need the, the broker needs to verify you are who you say you are. So now, examples of your proof of ID you can submit your driver's license, state ID, uh, passport, all of that is fine. Now, examples of proof of address, right? You can submit a utility bill, a photo of your utility bill, or a photo of your, your bank statement. What I did was I went straight to Bank of America, uh, dot com, um, and I downloaded a PDF of my bank statement so i didn't actually have to go in and, and take a picture or anything like that i just got a pdf of my bank statement actually dragged it here as proof of address and it was verified right so those are just a few examples of how to verify your account now let's get into the depositing aspect right how to deposit into your banking account so we always suggest uh, obviously you select your currency ours is usd we always suggest Bitcoin. Now, the reason we suggest Bitcoin, <clears throat> excuse me, is because the broker will actually insist that you withdraw with the same method that you deposit. And the thing with Bitcoin withdrawals is that they are almost instant. They are the fastest way to take money out of your trading account, out of your broker account, right? Typical withdrawal methods, the traditional methods, right? You have uh the wires right most people do wires thing thing about uh sending a wire is it'll take three to five business days to actually hit your your bank account with bitcoin it'll be instant i'm going to show you exactly what that is so now bitcoin as your method and i'm going to show you where to get bitcoin in a minute so now you select your deposit amount uh you can do anything right 90 bucks let's say before you redirect to payments page you're gonna actually need some Bitcoin to send, right? So let's go to our Bitcoin wallet, right? So this is our Bitcoin exchange that we use, coinbase.com. You need to create an account on coinbase.com. Trust me, it'll be the best thing you ever did, right? So create your account at coinbase.com. You're actually going to be asked to submit different things like, your bank information, you're gonna actually connect your bank information right here. If you have a PayPal, connect your PayPal and connect your bank account and debit card. This is the most important thing, debit card. I'm gonna show you why. So let, let's actually purchase some Bitcoin so we can send that over to our broker, right? You're gonna select Bitcoin, you're gonna view the asset, you're gonna buy, right? Let's say 90 bucks was what we wanna buy. Now you're gonna buy Bitcoin, make sure you says buy Bitcoin, and you're gonna pay with your debit card. You need to pay with your debit card. Now the reason you wanna pay with your debit card is because when you pay with your debit card, it is an instant purchase of Bitcoin. When you decide to pay with your bank account, it'll take a couple of days for the Bitcoin to actually hit your account. So select debit card like you have here, make sure you have that Visa sign or that MasterCard sign if you're paying with MasterCard, right? And this will be an instant purchase. So now you're gonna preview the buy. I'm not gonna do it because I actually already did it earlier. Preview the buy, purchase your Bitcoin. You're always, you also wanna purchase just a little bit more than you're intending to deposit over on this side. This will pay for the transfer fee. 
just a little bit more, maybe two, three bucks. I like to do five bucks, have some money left over there, right? Just a little bit more than you intend to deposit for your broker, for your Hugo's way. Preview your buy, purchase your Bitcoin, it'll be instant. Now, from there, you're going to go to redirect me to payments page from your Hugo's way account. Now, you the two most important things on this page is the amount of Bitcoin you're sending and the Bitcoin address. Read what it says. You're going to send this much Bitcoin to the below address. This is the below address, right? To get $90 into your account, into your broker account, right? So what you'll do after you purchase your Bitcoin, you're going to go to wallet. You're going to go to send, right? And right here on BTC, you're going to paste the exact amount of BTC that Hugo's Way put right here, right? And you're also going to paste, copy, and then paste when it said, where it says enter a BTC address. This is where you're going to be sending that $90, right? So now there's only about six bucks here. Like I said earlier, you're going to see earlier, I just uh, did a uh, transfer for 90 bucks. Oh, there we go. Again, copy that BTC number, go right here and paste it on the BTC. It'll convert it right here. Don't worry about this number. Hugo's Way will honor uh, the $90 once it gives you a confirmed amount of Bitcoin and a Bitcoin address. That's another question a lot of people have as well. The price of Bitcoin does change. It does not matter. Once you Bitcoin quotes you this much Bitcoin to get this much in your wallet, doesn't matter. You have actually it's approximately 15 minutes we already been through it it's approximately 15 minutes to actually make the transfer before they have to requote you um but as long as you get this done within 15 minutes which takes less than two minutes as long as you get this done within 15 minutes they will honor your 90 dollars. they will honor whatever price that you wish to deposit so now once you send that it's going to continue again there's only about six bucks in this account right here because i did it earlier but there's only six bucks left here, um, so it won't go through. But you're gonna continue, send that Bitcoin, and it'll hit your Hugo's Way within 30 minutes, 30 minutes to an hour, it'll hit your Hugo's Way account. So now after that, you go to my accounts, you can create an account. Once you're verified, you're gonna be able to create an account. Again, you get verified once you submit your documents. Account type. ECN, select your currency, leverage. We always recommend one to 300. Leverage, I always say leverage is kind of like fire. You need enough to, because fire can, you know, cook your food, heat up your home, but too much fire can actually burn your house down. You don't need too much leverage, right? Always recommend one to 300. Create your live account. I already have a few, so that's fine. Create your live account. Once you create your live account and the funds are in there, in your wallet up on the top left, you're going to go to internal transfers. This is how you transfer the money from your wallet into your trading account that you will create right here. See, once you deposit your, your, your money into your broker, it will not immediately reflect on your trading account. You have to transfer it from your wallet to your trading account. And this is how you do that. You're gonna go to internal transfer on the left, wallet to MT4, from your USD wallet, select your account and the amount you wish to transfer, right? That's how you would do that. From there, it will reflect into your trading account, right? There we have it. So now we did deposit, did KYC verification, now withdraw. This is how you withdraw from your broker account, right? If you're not there yet, you can skip off this video, hit the next tutorial. But if you are there yet, this is how you withdraw. So you're going to actually transfer your money from MT4 to wallet, from your trading account into your wallet. Let's say you, you made a thousand bucks this week and you want to withdraw 500. Transfer money from your MT4 to your wallet. Let's say here. From there to your USD wallet. Let's say you want to do 500 bucks, whatever the case is, request a transfer. It'll automatically transfer the money from your trading account into your wallet right here, right? From there, you go to withdraw. Select your wallet. It'll be this USD wallet. Select your type, 
we do Bitcoin, right? Select the amount. I think we will, we did 500. And then it's going to say Bitcoin address. This is where you go back to Coinbase when you're going to withdraw. Remember, this is where you go, right? So again, let's hit it from the top. Bitcoin, you're going to go to wallet. You're going to go to receive, right? This is the money you're going to be sending straight to your Bitcoin wallet, right? So it's going to give you an address and do pretty much do the reverse thing of a, of a deposit, right? Then you're going to copy paste that address right to your Hugo's Way account, right? That is how you withdraw. It'll send the money. You're going to request a withdraw. It'll send the money straight to your Hugo's Way account. What you'll do after that is you'll sell whatever Hugo's, whatever Bitcoin you have. You'll sell that. Let's say I want to sell this. You'll sell that straight to your USD wallet. Boom. And then you'll go portfolio, United States dollar, and then you go withdraw. So now you have a, a di different methods you can use. I suggest PayPal. If you have a PayPal account, I suggest PayPal because it'll be an instant withdrawal. It'll instantly hit your PayPal account. And from PayPal, you can instantly send it to your bank account or you just do straight to your bank account that'll be the amount and it'll take a couple days to hit your account i always suggest paypal because it's instant from there continue boom 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 deposited yep that's my paypal done now if i were to check my paypal right now it'll be right there for me to withdraw for me to transfer straight instant deposit to my bank account and that right there is everything you need to know about your broker, how to submit your documents, how to withdraw, how to deposit everything that you need. Now, when you create an account, it's gonna give you a login password. For instructions on how to get your trading account onto your MetaTrader 4, check out the MetaTrader 4 tutorial, right? So with that being said, thank you guys for tuning in. It's been Ty the God, your favorite trader, and then I'll see you guys on the other side.